right, I'm about to head to SF to see Olive and Steven. We're gonna get Gao Viet Kitchen and Bar, which is like this restaurant that went viral on TikTok. And they basically have fancy Viet food, I think, or like super extra pho with like lobster or something. I don't know, but um, I wanted to vlog it. It'll be my first time trying it and probably Olive's too. I think Steven already tried it, but yep. Those are the plans for today. Today I'm getting my hair done. Oh, well actually not really. I'm just getting my hair toned darker to a darker brown because it's sort of brassy at the ends now and the last time I got it toned was back in October or November of last year. So I just, I just need a touch up. And then for a haircut, I'm thinking of doing curtain bangs because I've always done long layers and it's kind of boring. So I just thought to go for a change and do something different this time. My curtain bangs is actually pretty subtle and because it, it blends into the rest of my hair, but that's what it looks like. We got this at 99 Ranch, right? Was it 99 Ranch? Basically, a, it's a block of oil and fat. With, with chilies and bay leaves, beef tallow, chili, MSG, salt. It's not tom yum, but it'll work. We're supposed to be cutting, but. Not this much. We are cutting. Are we? I mean, not after this shot. But yeah, we're, since we're cutting, we can't chase with soda. We have to chase with limes like real people <laughs> or normal people. This is only an issue for Teresa. <laughs> because we drink a lot of chase. Yes, we're supposed to cut sugar, fats, and simple carbs. Yeah, but then this. <laughs> Ignore that. I'm going to record the cut. Sour patch? Sour patch in Japan needs to look like a child. Shit about people. Lazy hot pot. Look bang, look bang, bang, look bang. Look bang. Then look at this meat. There's like no fat on it. I mean, barely any fat. And so we're suffering. This is the fat. <laughs> this is no fat, and then we're dipping it in fat. I have bad allergies today. Like the allergies just hit me, and I've just been sneezing all day, so I'm sort of out of it right now. And a little hungover from last night, but tonight I have a girl's dinner, and then I'm gonna do a little sip and paint at my house. I got a bunch of stuff from Daiso, a bunch of mini canvases, and um, the canvas holder, whatever that is. Uh, but it was all less than $50, everything, or it was like about $50 and for five people too, so it's pretty cheap. It's $10 per. I got these. So cute. And since we're gonna be drunk, I know we're not gonna be able to handle a bigger canvas, so this is like a 
like a three by five or something. And then I got this pack of paint from Michaels for like twenty dollars. All right, and then this is the outfit for Girls' Day. The girl said to wear floral, but I don't think floral looks good on me, so I just stole this from Vivian's closet. Maxi skirt with the slit, and then this white tube top that has this cute back to it. This is from <laughs> Pretty Little Thing. Um, yeah, I don't know where this top is from, but I think it goes well with this skirt. And then this is my hair. This is my hair shorter now. I have to do these little waves at the end of it because if I curl it, it's gonna be super short. So yeah, this is gonna be my hairstyle for a while until my hair is long again. We used to have each other's playlists Cheers to being young and sexy Don't know <laughs> We used to be each other's best friends Yeah And now we go our separate pathways But your heart's still in mine Yeah And maybe we could try it next week situated now okay guys welcome to Teresa delicious after hours <laughs> today we're gonna talk about relationships okay yeah but what topic <laughs> what's the next okay I'll ask something um who do you think should pay on the first date the guy oh really the guy should pay on the first date oh no it text technically like if Whoever invite whoever invited has to pay. Yeah, I That's agree. What I oh my God, we're the same person. We're the same person. <laughs> That's what I've been saying this entire time. I don't always expect the guy to pay. Uh -huh. I think whoever invites that person out should pay. Or I would yeah. like I like to put up a fight too for the bill. But I do think I agree with what you said. I think whoever invites the person out should pay. Cause I don't do the split the bill thing. If you split the bill, no. Now I'll never hey, see you again. You got me on half or what? <laughs> like, that, that, that will give me the ick, all right? No splitting the bill. <laughs> Would that give you the impression that they're cheap? Oh, yes. Right? Yeah, that's like- if they ask to yeah. split, they don't want to pay for like the entire thing. That, or maybe they're not that into me, right? It's a date, we're talking about a date. So like, uh -huh. I, I would think they're not that into me if they want to split the bill. Cause is it really, is money really a thing? Like you're just paying for my meal. Yeah, it's either it's that or just, they're just kind of frugal. 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 Sure, but like that would already give me the ick. And I'm like, nope. <laughs> well, yeah, your perspective. My, perspe my perspective, I mean, we have the same one. Cause, I know, um, right? Whoever invites the person, they should pay because it's just courtesy. Yeah. If, if I invite you, you know, you're, com you're taking your time out of your day to come and just spend time with me. Mm -hmm. No, of course I'll pay the bill. Yeah. Um, I agree. Or even like during the date, like let's say you go for dessert after and then you get that part. 
the other person. Yeah, to exactly. Like, like that. That is like ideal. Okay. Because I don't want to like make that person feel like I'm not appreciative of them taking the bill the first time. Yeah. <laughs> okay. What was your question? We had to cheers before we. Okay. My question is, what's um, what's the youngest you would go for? Oh, and what's the oldest that you would date? Oh god. Youngest and the oldest. Honestly, okay, I'm a 25, and I would only date someone who is like 24, like a year younger than me, if they have everything else that I need, everything, because I just can't do younger guys, because I can't even do guys my age. They're all they're not ready yet, so. Like, I don't think a guy younger than me will do me any favors. Like, I feel like he's still also in his fuckboy phase. But even if they show me that they're, like, loyal and, like, they'll be good to me, they still need everything else. Like, they're gonna need to be able to take care of me the way that I need. I mean, they're cute and, like, you know, like, maybe I'll talk to them, I'll give uh -huh. them a chance. But, um, like, in my head, I kind of already have that mindset where I'm just like, no. It's either my age or a little... A year younger. That's, like, the most. most. And the oldest I'll do is, honestly... 40? No! I won't even do 30. I wouldn't even do 30. Okay, I'll probably stop at like 29. 29? But like they have to have, they also have to have everything. I have more expectations for like older guys. But if you're like my age, so I have expectations for every. At this point, I still don't want to date someone that's 30 plus. Okay, but what about you? Because for guys, it's a little different. There's an equation that goes like this. Um, you divide your age by two and add six or add seven and that's the youngest you can date if you're 26 divide that by two that's 13 13 add seven. You add seven that's 20. is that a high five <laughs> <laughs> no it's not a high five 20 is so young to me when i was 20 i didn't know what the hell was going on okay it's so young is that not that's hella young I think imagine the, yourself at 20. i think the the youngest I dated was like 22. At, right, like right dating? Like, like on Hinge? I'm just saying like- I know, I know. I'm just, I'm not gonna be dating a 21 year old. That's crazy. That's crazy. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. How about older Oh yeah, women? they're just older women? Yeah. Like the oldest I would date? Yeah. What's your yeah. limit in general? Oh, if I were to date like an older, older person? Older woman, yeah. Like maybe like 31. Wow. Um, <clears throat> I don't know, they're just, they're they're wiser. They're they're more mature. They have more experience. Wow. Very open-minded. I wouldn't even date a, a guy that's thirty years old. What did you say? She's my love hole. What is that? Love of my life. Oh, love hole. Can I have so much more fun in L. A. Yeah, we're gonna go to L. A. Catch us in L. A. in June. Did you dress yet? No, I didn't. <laughs> I will though. Is he coming? Huh? <laughs> oh, no. I've been waiting for this long for Jeremy to get back.